you, Craig. Thanksgiving is now just days away. And preparations are underway to feed the thousands of homeless and needy families right here in Tucson. Gospel Rescue Mission has tons of turkeys stacked in their freezer for the holidays. And the business community has stepped up, donating not only money, but time to make these meals. But that's not the situation for the Salvation Army. The charity needs more donations and fast. Not on your sides, Valerie Cavazos joins us now with more. Yeah, I know. You've heard this charity cry for help before, just days away from Thanksgiving. But this situation took the Salvation Army by surprise. Donations took a deep dive, only a third of what they normally get at this stage of the game, and they're not sure why. Turkeys roasting in ovens. Cooked to golden brown perfection. Meat stripped and sliced from the bones and then stored away for a few days. The kitchen crew calculates how many turkeys are needed. We're getting, let's just say, we're getting six servings of bird at 12.5 12, 12 per day. Turkeys came in smaller this year, and so did the donations. This is the first time I've ever seen this um, season where we just don't have enough to go around. And Yoli Heffler has been at the charity for 10 years. She points to the shelves not stacked with all the trimmings. Well. Canned vegetables, you know, we would need more canned vegetables. Also bare, the floor. What would be in this area? Um, a lot of bags of donations that, um, you know, um, of everything. everything. We checked out the freezer where the potatoes and pies are stored. This whole area is full. There's stuff on the floor or on um, crates because it can't go on the floor, obviously. But this is, this is all that we have received to date. Okay, and so you so, still do need potatoes and mm -hmm. onions and, and all that? Um, yes. Since donations fell short, Chef Victor Hightower has no other choice. Well, I'll have to buy what I don't have. Time has simply run out. It'll cost a few thousand dollars, so they need donations first thing in the morning. Now, if you'd like to help, we have all the information, including the top food items, on our website, cake9.com. And if you can't donate just yet, they still need help through Christmas. Guy, Stella? Valerie, thank you.